There are two main ways to figure out which element on the periodic table is represented by this electron configuration here that ends in 3D64S2. The first way is just to count up all of the electrons in the configuration. So when we do that, we count all of these up, we end up with 26 total electrons for this electron configuration. Because on the periodic table, the atomic number, so this is the atomic number here, equals the number of protons, and all of these elements are neutral. They don't have a plus or a minus sign after them. That means that the number of protons, the atomic number, will equal the number of electrons. So we find the element with atomic number 26, iron right here. This is the element that's represented by this electron configuration. This is the long form or full electron configuration here for iron. We could write this in an abbreviated or a condensed form. So we'd find the element before iron, the noble gas before iron. So iron's 26, we go back and 18, argon here. So instead of writing all of these 18 electrons, these all add up to 18, we could just write AR in brackets. That would look like this here. So this is the condensed notation. Do note that in both of these notations, the 4s2, it's often written before the 3d6, just something to be aware of. There's another way we could figure out what element is represented by this electron configuration. We could use the periodic table broken up into blocks. So we're looking for the electron configuration here that ends in 3d6, 4s2. These are the valence electrons here for iron. So we have 1s1, 1s2, s is full with 2, we have 2s2, p, that can hold up to 6, so we have 2p1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 3s2, 3p6. Here's our 4s2, and that's followed by 3d. We want to find 3d6, so we go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, right here. This element should be the one that represents this electron configuration. There it is, iron, just like we found before. So those are two ways that you can figure out which element is represented by the electron configuration 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s2, 3p6, 3d6, 4s2. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.